Welcome back to Arsenal News TV and today we're going to first look at Arsenal outcast Marseille Guendouzi in advanced talks to secure Marseille transfer and then we're going to look at Riyad Mahrez's frustration admission amid talk of surprise summer transfer to Arsenal. So the first transfer headline states that Arsenal outcast Marseille Guendouzi in advanced talks to secure Marseille transfer. So the reports are stating that Matteo Guendouzi is closing in on a move away from Arsenal amid ongoing talks with Marseille, reports claim. The French midfielder found himself exiled from the Arsenal squad after a high-profile role with the Brighton star Neil Morpé, with Miklod Sessa taking a dim view of the clash. Matteo Guendouzi has spent the season on loan with German outfit Hertha Berlin scoring two goals and providing one assist in 24 Bundesliga appearances. But he looks set for a move to Ligue 1 with Marseille in advanced talks to sign him according to Foot Mercato. Talks have been ongoing between the relative parties for a matter of weeks and the midfield ace is said to be excited about a move to Marseille who finished 5th in Ligue 1 last season. He has he is keen on working with manager Jorge Sampaioli and he has been assured that he would be an important part of the club's project. Miklar Setzer sees no future for him at Arsenal and he is happy for him to leave the club, with Marseille confident of completing the transfer in a matter of weeks. It's set to be a busy summer at Arsenal, with Marcin Erdogan thought to be their number one transfer target. Emi Buendia is also being considered should they fail to sign their Real Madrid star. He was on loan at the Emirates for the second half of the season. And the Granite Xhaka is another player who could leave with Jose Mourinho keen to bring him to Roma in a £20 million deal. So it looks like Arsenal are definitely going to be very busy this summer transfer window. And it looks like Arsenal outcast Matteo Guendouzi is in advanced talks to secure Marseille transfer. So it looks like Matteo Guendouzi... He had a very good spell under Unai Emery at Arsenal. He was signed as a top prospect that could develop to be a top player. And it was something that Miklo Arteta's had a problem with, in my opinion. He had a problem with Matteo Guendouzi, the way he works in the squad, the discipline. There's a lot of things that Miklo Arteta and Matteo Guendouzi just don't get along with each other, in my opinion. And for me, Matteo Guendouzi is a top, top player. He could turn out to be a top, top player. And I think... He's going to be like one of those players like Serge Gnabry that we're going to regret after when they become to be a very good player. But when it comes to Miklos Sessa and especially Matteo Guendouzi, if you're not going to be disciplined to play in this football team, if you're not going to listen to your manager, if you don't show the respect to the other players and the staff around you, then it's going to be difficult to try and make any relationships at the football club, to try and get any happiness at the football club and even get chosen to even start for this football club. So for me, Matteo Guendouzi... Is a top player, he could be someone that Miklos says Arsenal will re regret after selling him. But for me, if your discipline is not there at the football club, if you're not going to show respect, then it's going to be difficult to say at this football club. So this nicely takes us on to the second piece of transfer news, which states that Riyad Mahrez's frustration admission amid talk of surprise summer transfer to Arsenal. So the reports are stating that the latest Arsenal news includes Comments from Riyad Mahrez regarding a block move to the Emirates Stadium five years ago, with the winger once again being tipped to join the Gunners. Riyad Mahrez has emerged as a transfer target for Arsenal ahead of a big summer for Miklos Sessa and technical director Edu, and this is according to the Daily Mail, who also claimed that the Gunners are interested in fellow Manchester City winger Raheem Sterling as Pep Guardiola looks to freshen up his squad ahead of next season. Of course, Arsenal manager Miklos Sessa knows both players well from his time at the Etihad Stadium. In fact, Sterling has already delivered a glowing verdict on the Spaniard, which I has done a video on before yesterday, praising his management style in comments that would become more relevant as the summer progresses. But in terms of Riyad Mahrez, it's not the first time that Algeria International has been linked to the move to the Emirates Stadium. With interest from Arsenal's side stretching all the way back to when with Arsene Wenger was in charge. Interestingly, Mahrez labelled the Gunners a top team after revealing the frustration at seeing a move blocked in the summer of 2016 during his time at Leicester City. After the title, 
If I had left for a top team, it wouldn't have been the same story, he told France Football in November 2019. For me, it's clear that I lost two years at the highest level. I lost two years because instead of arriving at City at 27, I could have been there at 24-25. Leicester blocked me, they told me you're not leaving, you're not leaving. My agent had spoken to Arsene Wenger who really wanted me. It was nearly all done with Arsene in 2016, I was really frustrated. It wasn't easy going to being going from the be, being the best player in the Premier League to being a part of a team fighting against relegation. It's not the same job. Everyone is waiting for you around the corner. We had Morris's contract at the Etihad Stadium expires in 2023, and his estimated transfer value, as per the CIES Football Observatory, is between 40 million euros to 50 million euros, which is roughly 34 million pounds to 42 million pounds. With no European football, on offer next season, Fottens at the Emirates Stadium are likely to be limited this summer, although the club plans to generate £60 million from player sales. Whether that would tempt um, Mahrez into a switch remains to be seen as a season not in Europe could prove costly. Having finished in 8th position, the Gunners are set for their first season without European football in a quarter of a century. And with Riyad Mahrez being linked with the Gunners is a very surprise summer transfer move in my opinion. I think if Arsenal are going to develop as a team going forward, I think we should go for talent that we have already at the club in my opinion. We can't go for Riyad Mahrez as we can clearly see he's what he messed up the opportunity to win the Champions League versus Chelsea yesterday. But when it comes to Riyad Mahrez, I think he's a top top player. But for me, I don't want to see him at the Gunners now. I think he's going to stunt the growth for Nicola Pepe. We saw what William prevented Nicola Pepe from what he's doing right now. So for me, I don't want to see this transfer happen at all. But even though he's a top, top player. But other than that, guys, remain blessed. Stay tuned for the next video and peace.